Hello again, boys and girls. Welcome to another video about finger play with little rhymes. And today, as promised, I'm going to show you how to make little paper finger puppets. You may have recognised some of these from rhymes we've already done in our little videos. So we have a little blackbird, um, a fish, a spaceman, and there's also a little mouse there. You can make the puppets into any creatures you want. In fact, at the end of this video, I'll post a, another link to a rhyme and someone is doing a finger rhyme with all sorts of different superheroes. So your puppets could be whoever you want. And all you need to create these are some pens or pencils. And if you have a little sticky post-it note pad. Now a post-it notepad, um, often they're yellow, they can be different colours, um, is a little square with a sticky side. So that's why they're wonderful for creating these. If you don't happen to have post-its available, do not worry. You will just need a little bit of glue or perhaps some tape to stick with some scissors and a piece of paper, just scrap paper. And in the corner of that paper, if you cut a little square, that will be perfect. Now this square should roughly be about the size of the palm of your hand, okay? So there you go, about that size. So it's roughly about the same size as the post-it note, okay? And what you would do is just do put glue down one side of here. So I will show you with the post-it note, here goes. So we're gonna take the sticky side of the post-it and we're gonna fold it into the middle, leaving just a little um, gap at the end. And then you're gonna take the other side and roll it in. So you're making like a tube, okay? Hello. So you've made a tube with your post-it and it's stuck together on itself. Then you are gonna fold down one end like so. Okay, and you're pretty much there already. So you've got your tube and you can stick your finger in the end of it and wiggle and waggle like that. Now do you see this flappy bit? To make a kind of head shape, because that's often where the head of the character will go, what you're gonna do is you are just gonna fold in the bottom corners and I think that's quite a good face for maybe a mouse or a bird because it's got like a pointy nose there he goes okay doot, 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 doot. but before we're finished we need to decorate him so I am going to create this little creature what do you say we make a mouse I'll give him a little nose and a little mouth here he goes and then I'll give him his eyes, blue eyes. And with the other pen, I'm going to do some details. So let's see, let's give him some round ears, like a big mousy ears. And I'm going to give him a round body and a big wiggly tail. There he goes, with some little feet and some little paws. And there is my, oh, I think one more thing. I'm going to give this mouse some whiskers. And lo and behold, here he is. Maybe you can think of a finger rhyme with a little, little, little mouse. Can you think of one? Hickory dickory dock, the mouse ran up the clock. Think of the other end of that. And as I said, create any finger puppet you wish. Have fun. Good to see you, boys and girls. Bye.